What's up everyone? Today we're doing 12 moves. We're doing them for 40 seconds on the 10 seconds break in between each move. We're going to be doing that twice, so there's two rounds. The equipment that you'll need for today is just a pair of heavy dumbbells for all your chest stuff and then a lighter pair of dumbbell with, for all your shoulders because we're doing like lat raises and all that kind of stuff. If you don't have light dumbbells at home, just go and grab any light objects in your house that'll do the trick, whether you're using like books or cans of foods or water bottle, it'll all work. If you enjoy this workout at the end of the video, if you could please press the like and subscribe button, that would help me out a lot to grow the channel and get you more workouts. Let's get warmed up here. Okay, we're gonna start by loosening up the upper back here. So you're just gonna go get on all fours and then here I'm inhaling as my elbow goes up and then I'm exhaling as my elbow goes down. And every time that your elbow goes up, see if you can reach up at the ceiling a little bit more. loosening up the shoulder so keep your arms straight keep your chest and your belly button facing the ground here and then as you can see I'm slowly rotating my arm and then when I'm finishing the back of my wrist is facing my hip and then you just go back and forth on the same side one here for the warm-up but just let's go through our scapular push-ups so I'm keeping my arms straight and I'm trying to move my shoulder blades back and forth you can do this uh, from your feet or you can put your knees on the ground it doesn't matter what I really want you to focus on is feeling those shoulder blades get close together and then far apart All right, everyone, well, let's get this started. We're gonna start with uh, chest presses here. You got five seconds, let's get in position.
For these next push-ups, I'm using my dumbbells so I can go a little bit lower into the push-up. If you don't have dumbbells, you can use books and you can also do regular push-ups. for this next move is that we keep our hips nice and stable so we don't want to be swaying side to side it we should just feel our shoulders moving and that will get your core to light up a little bit And with all our shoulder presses and exercises here, just make sure that you're not arching your back, okay? You want to keep your core nice and tight and just press the weight straight up.
work, everyone. For this next move here, I really want you to keep your glutes nice and tight, okay? And just have the chest raised off the ground just a little bit. We don't have to go too high up. Really focus on reaching as far as you can with your hands and then just pull your elbows back. When you're pulling the elbows back, pretend like you're pulling something towards you, kind of like a lat pull down at the gym. For these next push-ups, I'm trying to push myself away from the ground as high as I can. And I'm going to do three push-ups like this on one side and then three on the other side. Nice work, everyone. You are halfway. Let's take a one minute break. Let's regroup, have a drink, shake it out, and then we're going to do this one more time.
work everybody you got three moves to go and then you're all done the workout keep it up
Nice work, everyone. Oh, that was tougher than I thought. Enjoy the rest of your days.